Welcome to this video. In this video, I would like to show and explain you how you can easily install ABAP to Excel. I think if you work with Excel within your SAP system as a ABAP developer, you should definitely use this open source tool because yeah, it's like a, a little treasury because there are so great useful classes to work uh, with Excel um, and SAP especially if you if you would like to transfer data into Excel and so on you should definitely work on this tool and you don't uh, have to reinvent the whole wheel so just use this great tool and in this video I would like to um, yeah to to install and to use this tool and first of all you have to make sure that the ABAP Git tool is uh, set up into your system as a standalone version or as a developer version, doesn't matter, but you need definitely ABAP Git in order to install ABAP to Excel. And if, to make sure and to prove if it's uh, set up there, you have to open up the transaction code SE38. And then within here, you have to use use the report set ABAP git underscore standalone. So uh, yeah, here we can see that this program is definitely there. So we execute it right now. And then basically, yeah, you should definitely reach to this page. If the program is not there, um, please, I will link a video how you can set up ABAP git quite easily on your own. This is a needed um, prerequisite. And then you have to click on the new online button. And within here, you have to enter this git repository repository URL. I will put the link or the URL in the video description, of course. And then within package, you have to here specify a local package. So for example, um, dollar ABAP to Excel. Um, please make sure if you would like to use um, the ABAP to Excel open source tool within your quality system or within the productive system. And then of course you have to specify a package um, and, and that you can transport to the quality and to the productive system. So that's really, really important. So, and then you have to click on the create online uh, repo button. If you, for example, get this kind of error, then the, the root cause of this that the SSL is not configured correctly in the S-Trust uh, transaction, um, but to easily um, get rid of this error, you can also install um, ABAP to Excel offline. And to do this, first of all, you have to go to this page. I will link the link uh, in the video description and then you have to download the code. So then to download the zip. And then once this is downloaded, then once again, you go into the ABAP Git. So we're going here back and then you click on new offline. And then within the repository name, you enter ABAP to Excel. And within the package, what you like to, so for example, a local package in my case, and then you can click on create offline repo and within here if you want to for example a short description so for example above to excel tool that's perfectly fine and then you have to click on import zip then you have to select the zip file you have to uh, allow the transfer of this data, it's perfectly fine. And then you have to click on pull zip. You have to make sure that all the objects are selected. Or here it's perfectly fine, so it, uh, it's overridden. So yeah, that seems to be really, really great. I confirm this. 
Then you have to activate all those objects, so I confirm it. Okay, great, and now you have successfully installed ABAP2, excellent. And if we're going, uh, if we're scrolling down a little bit, yeah, that seems all perfectly fine. So we're going here once again, and now what we have to do normally, um, again, you can also pull a online repository for the demos. I will show you within here. But unfortunately, based on my SSL um, setup, I'm not able to pull it. So therefore, I can also do it once again offline to do this. So therefore, I click on code, download the zip, and then I'm going once again to the ABAP git. I click on new offline, and then within the repository name, within the repository name, I select this one. Here, keep in mind that uh, if you would like to specify a package, you should not use underscore demo for because it was sometimes replaced. So just use um, this, for example. And here it is highly recommended to use a local package because here yeah, I think the demos are not necessary. I don't need it within the quality or within the productive system. So yeah, that's perfectly fine. And here we click on create offline repo. Uh, here, once again, just enter a small uh, short description. So, for example, yeah, just uh, demo, doesn't matter. And then I continue and then I import the zip once again. That's perfectly fine. I pull it. Yeah, it's great. So now I activate those objects once again. And now, yeah, congratulations, you have successfully also installed the demo programs. And to prove that you have installed it successfully, we open up the ABAP editor, so the transaction code SE38. And within here, I would like to call the report set ABAP to Excel underscore demo underscore show. Oh, where was it? Set ABAP to Excel underscore demo underscore show. And then I execute it. And here right now you have all the demo programs um, available and shown and for example if we double click on one then immediately this program will be shown and in a different screen Excel will be opened up here you can see the basic program of ABAP to Excel and here right now if we for example analyze we can see the result but if we analyze it then we can see that yeah um, a, a Excel file will be created and different values will be put into different cells. So yeah, really, really useful. And as you might see, it is so easy to create Excel files within SAP. And yeah, happy trying out ABAP to Excel. If you have any questions left regarding ABAP to Excel, any demo programs, any purposes, whatever, please put them in the comment sections, like this video, and please subscribe my YouTube channel to support my work and to never miss great upcoming videos. Thank you so much and then see you in the next video.